Next, we go to Malaysia and meet city volunteer Cho Wen Liang and recycling volunteer Tang Wei Ling, whose lives turned around 180 degrees since they began watching Dye TV. Cho quit fishing as a hobby and took on a vegetarian diet, while Tan got rid of his bad temper. Tutti volunteer Chou Wenliang has been caring for the immobile Zhong Shi Fa for many years now. Today, he went out of his way and purchased a gift for Zhong. It turns out to be a television. We only finished setting it up at 1 or 2 o'clock. I want to see more of the master and watch her Dharma lectures. While the Shi Fa's leg was amputated, so it's an inconvenience for him to go out, so we came to him instead. Cho decided to bring the stream of purity into Zhong's home, as he himself became a changed man as a result of watching Dai TV. It was during the time of Cyclone Nagas in Myanmar and the Sichuan earthquake. The master was spreading the message of no killing. The moment I heard that on Dai TV, I immediately quit fishing and adopted a vegetarian diet. Often, the smallest of things can change one's life forever. It was Dai TV that turned Tang Weiling's bad temper around. I had a bad temper back then, but since I began watching the master's teaching and since the aphorisms through the ITV, I became a better person. Every turning point takes you on a different road with different scenery. For volunteers Chou Wenliang and Tan Weiling, their turning point in life was the ITV, which opened their hearts to truth, goodness and beauty. <laughs> Ah,